this is Holly Hashup, and I'm an RN from Texas. I'm here at the Dallas headquarters to take a look at one of the newest diode hair removal lasers on the market today, the Aslepion Meteostar. Come on, let's take a look. As an RN with six years of working with various hair removal lasers, I've been frustrated with how long the treatments take and how painful they can be. It's nice to see a laser like the Aslepion Meteostar from Estanza address each of these issues and finally design a laser that practitioners want to use. Patients love it as well. It's fast, pain-free, and does a great job. Hi, I'm Josh with Estanza Laser. I'm a biomedical engineer here by schooling and by training. I've been here for about five years and I'm here to run through how to use the Mediastar monolith. You're gonna have your three kind of beginning buttons in the opening screen. The first is gonna be the start button. It's gonna go to whatever setting we were using last and it'll just start it up. The big key feature for me, especially when I'm treating multiple different areas and, and different patients and different skin tones, is I like to do my indications feature so that I can go in and jump right into what I'm looking for. Star is one of my favorite devices, especially for people who are long time in the industry or who are really just kind of brand new to doing laser hair removal. Mm -hmm. uh, and it's just because the indications here are w wonderful. They're very, very, very easy to use and they're very, very dynamic, right? They're pretty much appropriate for the skin types and the, and the position that you're using it on the body. So again, let's go to epilation, right? Face, I wanna use a smaller hand piece. Let's say we're doing those unfortunate chin hairs that we're looking for in the skin type two, right? Density is fine, thickness is probably gonna be pretty thin and then we can go ahead and go. And then, on the body. Sorry about that. Come back here. Step two, yes. And we're ready to go. And you don't have to click through all those, but you can see that there's a lot more jewels and a lot shorter time frame. Mm -hmm. And then if we come back, and our next patient is gonna be somebody who's a skin type three, looking to do roughly the same thing. So we'll go to skin type three, we'll look at the area of the body on the face, uh, but let's say that it's a man's face at this point in time and they're looking to line up a beard. Let's say the density is going to be a little higher and let's just say that the thickness is going to be a little bit higher as well. Right. And then if we go ahead and go here, you can see that it automatically changes the settings, right? It has our pulse duration and our jewels changed up and then of course if you wanted to go a little bit faster, we can always do that as well, depending on your comfort level. Um, if we're looking at skin type 6, right, everybody wants to have the ability to treat even the darkest skin patients, so we come up to a skin type six. We're here, area gonna be the body, let's say we're gonna do legs. We'll come over and do the extra large. Type six. Density of the hair is a little bit more, but I would probably say the density is probably gonna be about average. And then we can go ahead and click our settings. And then you can see that the fluence level is down. We have shortened our time duration out to be able to accommodate that. And then of course, speed is always gonna be one, but it's up to you as a practitioner on how, comfort, how comfortable you are moving forward. Go. And the machine knows exactly what you're looking for, and we'll go ahead and pre-populate those. Preset settings, okay, mm -hmm. great. So to keep the hand pieces clean, we usually just use kind of standard shrink wrap. Mm -hmm. which I have here, super easy to apply. Pull a little sheet off here, and put your thumb right here on the XL. Okay. All right, so you put that here, put it right on the XL. Then we're just gonna stretch it tight, come around the front, wrap it around the back, and then what we're gonna do is we're actually gonna come up here. And this is just gonna prevent us from getting gel all over the place. Right, and okay. As much as I try to be clean with it, I usually wrap it down a hand piece a little bit because I get a little bit messy. Right. Just gonna kind of straighten it out a little bit. And you're ready to go. All right. So what you're hearing right now is you're hearing the um, cooling startup on this so that we're going to be ready to rock and roll. Okay. Just hit this and then we'll basically have this, we'll cool down to the specific temperature that you're looking for and then you'll be away, ready to treat at that point. Um, so now we're ready right here so everybody would have their goggles on. And then when you're treating, remember that the front part of the head here is cooling. So if you're pulling down, you want to have a little about a 25% overlap, which is pretty common in the industry. It's pretty familiar. Uh, and then you can go pretty fast. Okay. And as far as passes go? Uh, single pass. One single pass. One single pass. Okay. Yep. We're in the st static. Mm -hmm. Okay. Kind of getting the machine ready to rock and roll. Do you have any additional questions for me? Um, no, I think we're good.
All right, well then I'll let you get to it. Okay, thanks. Hi, I'm Holly. I'm gonna be your practitioner today. Hi, I'm Whitley, nice to meet you. Nice to meet you too. Um, so here are some little protective goggles Thank for you. you to put on. And I just wanted to let you know um, that the Monolith XL has the 360 cooling around it, so it should make the treatment really comfortable. Okay, great. Do you have any questions? I don't think so, I'm excited. Okay, great. Let's get started. All right. So the gel um, helps with movement, uh, helps it glide, and then also helps pull the energy um, into the skin. They either put too much or too little gel on it. Just a nice thin layer. Once you, go over, once you get over top of it, for me, I've been doing it for a little while. When I'm done, like there's almost, it's almost absorbed or dried out at the point in time when I'm done. So it's just like, like I just go like where I'm going and then the next place is just very fine layer. So I'm just gonna do the top. Sure. Okay. Do? Oh, um, I'm just kind of marking my place okay. for whenever we uh, turn over. Okay. You know, I know where to start. How far down do you get hairs? Oh yeah, right to like right before my ankles, right about like right there, where you were. Yeah. How'd that feel? Didn't feel anything. That's awesome. <laughs> so would you do this again? Oh, for sure. Most definitely. Wonderful. Yeah, it's actually a really good investment over time. Oh yeah, for because sure. Because then you're saving on all of that shaving supplies. And the hassle. Oh, That's yeah. the worst part. Right. Not to mention if you actually nick yourself. Oh yeah, this is so easy, this is great. Now you can tell all the people you know that you had hair removal and it didn't hurt. <laughs> for sure, I will definitely tell my friends about it. Yeah. How many sessions does it normally take? So it really depends on um, the person and genetics and everything. Um, I mean, it could be five sessions, it could be maybe even up to eight. It just really depends okay. on um, your body. And then also if people are on any sort of hormones or pregnancy can change hair growth, all kinds of stuff like that. Okay, you ready? I'm ready. Yeah, the handpiece is really easy to maneuver considering how big the spot size is. It's really cool. I just can't believe how painless it is. Yeah. Last leg. I'm ready. So you're going to keep coming back here and get laser treatment? Definitely. <laughs> I guess since it's a square, you can really turn it like any which way. Yeah, it's awesome. You don't have to worry about like an orientation or a weird hot spot with this one either because the hand piece itself is fully homogenized. So whatever comes out of that window is the same as anywhere else in that window. I know the hand piece is a little larger, but pretty easy to use so far. Yeah, for such a large hand piece, it really is. So now we're going to do your underarms. Okay. How do you feel? I'm excited. Good. My legs didn't hurt, so I'm hoping this doesn't hurt. I don't think it will. And it'll be a lot faster, too. You're not feeling anything? Every once in a while, I feel a zing, but for the most part, not much. As an RN with six years of working with various hair removal lasers, I've been frustrated with how painful the treatments can be for clients and how long the treatments take. It's nice to see a laser like the Aslepion Medio Star from Estanza address each of these issues and finally design a laser that practitioners want to use. Patients love it as well. It's pain-free, fast, and does a great job. My treatment today was great. I was really nervous about pain, but it was zero pain. It was awesome. I have never had laser hair removal, so that's why I was pretty nervous coming in here, but Holly made the experience really great. I expected a little bit of burning or popping sensation during the treatment, but I only experienced that maybe once or twice. The treatment was very fast. I was very surprised how fast the treatment was. I will definitely be getting laser hair removal again in the future, for sure.